Supreme Court has directed the Sahara Group to hand over title deeds of its properties worth 20,000 crores to SEBI within three weeks. Failing this, the Apex Court has said promoters cannot leave the country. Ashpreet uh, joining us. Ashpreet, just take us through a little bit more on what some of the court's concerns are. Well, once again, coming down heavily on Sahara, the Supreme Court has given a strong observation that, saying that Sahara has done enough of hide and seek and has asked Sahara to produce title deeds, rather original title deeds, of properties worth 20,000 crore rupees to SEBI. The Supreme Court has directed Sahara to submit these title deeds within three weeks. And if Sahara uh, companies fail to comply with this Supreme Court order, then Sahara promoters will not be allowed to leave the country. That is what the Supreme Court has said to Sahara. Uh, Supreme Court has also observed that if Sahara pays money to the court, it is rest assured that the company and promoters will be uh, saved and protected. And Sahara has driven everybody around the bend by not abiding by the previous Supreme Court orders of repaying the investors with an amount of two, two 25,000 crore rupees. Uh, Sahara, uh, the Supreme Court also gave an obs observation that there cannot be easy escape and money needs to be repaid to the investors. And they cannot trust Sahara too much as already. Already a lot has been evaded by Sahara as far as Supreme Court's orders is concerned. SEBI, of course, told the Supreme Court that they do not see any uh, need for uh, Sahara to sub, uh, submit title deeds. Rather, they should uh, sell off one-third of the properties and repay the investors as directed by the Supreme Court. Sahara told the Supreme Court that as per the compliance of the order, which they plan to do after three weeks, each company will give the certificate about the ownership of property and director's re resolution will also be given. Uh, uh, Sahara also told the Supreme Court that they are likely to give 30,000 title deeds for 2,500 crores of properties. The Supreme Court will, of course, resume the hearing on November 20th after replies from Sahara and SEBI are received.